Hi everyone. Welcome back to another Face Mask Friday. Ah. Ah. And what are we doing today, Corey? Today we're doing our last week of Seventh Heaven Face Masks. And yeah. I'm pretty excited because there's yours. Yeah. I'm doing chocolate. I guess I'm doing argan oil. Yeah. So this is the Seventh Heaven Chocolate Mud Mask. It's recommended for combination oily skin. It's antioxidant rich. First have to cleanse your face, then apply. Then you just relax for 15 minutes. Exactly, not like 10 to 15 like mine. 15 exactly. And then rinse and feel, does it say feel peachy? Yep. And then feel peachy. And you can see this one is almost all natural ingredients, just a couple man-made ingredients. Oh, cool. I have the argan oil. Boom. Almost got it first time. Um, so yeah, argan oil. It deep, deeply cleanses and balances skin. I was looking for it to balance skin. Oh. Oily and not oily parts. Just, okay, yeah. so it just makes it more oily all over. To, because I'm super oily, no, so it's then it just take away the oil and also like moisturize where you need it. So it adds oil, it takes away oil. Yeah, it's not just oily. It's not it's just moisturizing. Just it's balance and just, just add not, nothing you know. but oil here, and so then it matches. No. Damn, that would have been gross but fun. I'm rambling. So first we have to cleanse, then apply, then relax for 10 to 15 minutes. I have a little leeway with mine. Um, then rinse, and as well, I need to feel peachy afterwards. Yeah. So is yours vegan? Um. Mine's vegetarian mine and PETA approved. is also vegetarian and PETA approved. We're gonna do these, I guess. This sounds like fun, doesn't it? Yeah, we haven't done a mud mask in a long time. Well, you did, I guess. Yeah, I was thinking like I did recently, didn't I? That was good, but at that time, this is a fun fact, I wish I had shaven. Today, yeah, like, I didn't. What do you guys think? Let's everybody vote uh, up here. Yeah. Shave or no shave? Is he looking rugged? It's like a week's worth without shaving. Like, how? It's because we had a commenter comment on his shave routine. Yes. And then he was like, well, that's it. I have to stop shaving. Pretty much. No, we will actually do like a <laughs> shaving video because it is something I kind of know about. That but is like classy shaving tools. I do. Um, but because it's also winter time, I don't really want to shave on a regular basis because it's just uncomfortable. So like I fell and got a band-aid. <laughs> yep. Anyway, sorry to interrupt. <laughs> so for a little while I might not be clean shaving, but um, it shouldn't really affect mud masks. It's really the sheet yeah, masks it should that is the problem. Mask. Yeah, this thing already is really itchy. It has this really interesting tear to open detail. So hopefully it's not super messy. So I'm gonna tear it open. I also have that, but I screwed it up, so, um, well, sorry. Well, one works better than the other. This will be, like, an actual test. Yeah, mine. Okay, there we go. I guess that works. It smells amazing. It smells like chocolate. It does smell like chocolate. Like, what I'd... else would you expect, but... What do you think of mine? Yeah, it smells... It smells fresh. It smells a little perfumey. What's in there? Argan oil. And I don't think argan oil smells like anything. Not a whole lot. Oh, berries. Oh. It's got a acai or a kai or whatever in it. Yeah. <laughs> and rose hip. And... Oh my uh, god, we're going to get motion sick. Look out, earthquake! Yeah, it also has a uh, squeezed rose hip, too. Like so. mine pipes out like chocolate icing. Oh my god. <laughs> don't <laughs> eat it. I wanted to kind of taste it. No. Viewers at home do not eat it. It doesn't say it's food safe. Yeah. But it doesn't taste that bad. I don't want to eat your face mask. <laughs> it feels like chocolate mousse. I'm so like happy right now. I've been oh waiting God. for weeks to do this one. <laughs> like don't eat it, but it didn't taste bad is all I'm going to say. God. This feels like I just like stuck my hand in like that jar of icing. From like best birthday party. Oh and yeah. Just, like going to town. Cause everyone will know that what that reference is like. <laughs> we made these like Paddington Bear cupcakes, cupcakes at a yeah. party, like as a group event. I'll post a picture here. Over my face. Over buddy. your face. 
And oh, they were really cute, but uh, this is like Mine was the cutest. Flashback, flashbacks. But yeah, and yes, the face mask is a very similar consistency. That was the moral of the story. Because I had to have a moral. Because morals are important. Oh my god, I can smell it from here. That's Yours very... looks funny. <laughs> Sorry. It's not the color I expected it to be. No, not really. But her... this one is very chocolatey. So, like, yep. I'm just putting it all over my nose. Because if it gets in my nostrils, it's like all the better. I was thinking that would be torture, but okay. <laughs> And then it's like, you can, there's chocolate everywhere, but you can't eat it. Oh, I would eat it. Oh my god, of course you would. You should try some. Viewers at home, comment below. Should <laughs> I try some? Here, I'll scrub some up for you. Just touch your tongue to it. <laughs> right? It's a weird texture. <laughs> It's no. very powdery tasting. It's like a dry eye thing. But Maybe that's the crushed minerals. Don't eat it. No, I got poop on my band. Uh, <laughs> what do you guys think about this hairband? I got it at like Home Sense for like five dollars. Supposed to be for face masking specifically. Hmm, I didn't know that. Yeah. I think you're supposed to tie all your hair up, but obviously. I mean, mean, yeah, God, I really think we are, like, people who aren't vain, but we can make YouTube videos this at about, home alone? yeah. <laughs> oh, God, it's going all over my hair. Now, should I add it to the beard? Yes. Argan oil is actually, like, oh, yeah, an oil true. that you use for your hair. Um, like I just did a couple of weeks ago an argan oil shampoo and conditioner, the one that smells like Thai curry. I don't know if you tried that one. <laughs> yes, I did. Um, but yeah, that's like the main ingredient in those. So I think it'll be amazing. Like so far, it's really cold here in Alberta and he's been complaining about his beard being itchy. Oh, dry yeah. skin, dry lips, like it's all really bad. So I think this will be really good for him. Okay. Well, here we go. Really get it in there. I definitely feel like I had just the right, right amount for me. Um, like any less than I would not have had enough. For me, it's a bit difficult because the hair does absorb a lot. Oh, so you need like extra, extra. Yeah, if you're going to be doing a face mask, like a clay mask with a beard, it absorbs almost all of it. That might be when it's good to buy those big tubs in like the body shop one Ooh, that we were dissing. Might be a good it call. It's like kind of boring if you buy the same ones over and over again. And you get so much, but that would be... Yeah, if you actually have, like, like need the amount. And yeah, I don't have any down here because I don't have enough. I'll have to put some on the bottom of my neck. Well, so. if you didn't drop it all. <sighs> um, but yeah. So yeah, we're going to let chill and let these go on for, like, 15 minutes. Exactly 15 minutes. And we'll be back after that. So, bye. Bam! Yay. We're back. We are back. Mine probably could use a couple more minutes to dry out. I'm a little, and it's been longer than 15, I'd say it's been probably 20, I know. 25. Despite the fact I hammered in, hers is exactly 15 mm -hmm. minutes. I wasn't very diligent. But we're busy, um, we gotta get going, so we gotta wipe them off anyway. Yep. And mine feels like dry and hardened, but not uncomfortably hard. No. Like it's got some give. If yeah. I smile, I don't look totally horrible. Toby disagrees, but... Um, <laughs> Can you smile? Smell big, crack it. See, it's not totally horrible. No, not too bad. Um, it did feel like it loosened up after I did that, but it's not like one of those ones where it really like feels like it like sucks in onto yeah, your face. Yeah, your neck is super cracky, but like your cheeks aren't. Hmm. We brought some uh, yeah, face, regardless. Matt, uh, face cloth, but we're going to have to go to the sink, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's how it always goes with these. That doesn't come off too bad. No. So we're just going to take the rest of these off, and we'll be back in a second again. All right, we're back. We are Let me indeed take off my back. cool hat. So what so, do you think? Yeah, how do you feel? Pretty good. Um, 
It does actually feel fairly nice on the beard. It does feel a little bit softer. Yeah. Probably should have added it some here because it's usually where I'm itchiest. That sucks. But whatever. Um, but yeah, it actually feels really good. And like, not on the beard, I feel fairly cleansed. Yeah, I feel like dry, so, like it's really sucked up all the extra oil. A little bit, yeah. And it but... does feel really soft. So I definitely feel like I want to moisturize right away. So I personally am going to be using my Kate Somerville Goat Milk Moisturizer. Look at this cool bottle. Ooh. Oh my god. Um, for my face, I'll be using my Dove Men's Care thing. And for my beard, I'll be using beard oil. Not too bad so far, so I'll probably use it some more. Um, yeah. I'll be what brand using is it? that. Oh, yeah, sorry. It's Jack Black. Um, Jack Black, authentic, BN original beard oil. With Kalahari melon oil and vitamin E. You like melons? I do. I also like saying Kalahari. Kalahari. Yeah, I've never actually like seen that word written out. So that's fun. Um, but yeah, let's put this on. Oh yeah, sorry. I'm also gonna give myself a spurts of fix plus because I feel like that would be refreshing. Literally just an oil, which is nice. You want some fix plus? No. I do not eat, at least. <laughs> Overall, I'd say when I had the mask on, there was really no sensation other than it just being a mud mask. It wasn't cooling. No, it's... It smelled really good. It's kind of like a th aromatherapy if you're really into chocolate. You were saying how much you liked your smell. Yeah, mine was a very mild smell, but it's like kind of berry... full. Berry full? Berry some. Berry some. It goes on kind of like a thick liquid icing. Thickens up nice and hard, and then washes off pretty easy. I'd say decently easy. Yeah. Um, for a beard, you really do have to kind of scrub a bit to get to the skin layer, mm -hmm. but other than that, it's fine. These guys retail for $2 at a ton of drugstores here in Canada, like Ooh. Walmart, London Drugs. Oh, I'll leave a list of all the places you can get them down below. And these two were sent to us by Farley Clo along with the rest of, rest of our 7th Heaven face mask. So a big thanks to them. Yeah. However, we weren't sponsored to say anything. This is all our honest opinion. So Yeah, so try to believe us. <laughs> um, so what would you give it out of 5? I might say 3.5. 3.5? Yeah, it's pretty solid. Um, worked well with a beard. Um, I do feel fairly cleansed. I'm putting a little bit more beard oil on, by the way. Um, so, yeah, I liked it. Yeah. What'd you think? I would give mine five out of five in terms of it being a mud oh. mask and it being a chocolate. Like, it's just kind of like this weird okay. fantasy where you, like, <laughs> spread chocolate on your face and it, like, is good for you. So I liked it a lot. I thought it smelled good. I thought it didn't taste that bad. Good. I'm glad you liked it a lot. <laughs> I was really excited to like try it. And yeah, I thought it was a really nice face mask. It was pretty comfortable to wear. I'll have to get you more chocolate face masks. <laughs> yeah. Um, or just chocolate. Or have, just like, chocolate. Party. We could just make our own chocolate face mask with real chocolate. Just, like 100% like, milk chocolate. Yeah. Just, oh my God. Toby's acting crazy right now. So he's like, he's why, excited about that. Why is your acne flaring up on your chin? And I'll be like, Something I have like, no idea. Why are you in the hospital? Oh, I just put <laughs> fondue chocolate on my face. You know? <laughs> yep. Yeah, okay. Like, so, cool. Yeah. <laughs> I would totally repurchase. <laughs> yep. I'm there. I thought the packaging was like sufficiently good. Mud masks are always going to be kind of dirty, but I thought the little yeah, but, yeah, thing that was clever. was probably a good idea to do. <laughs> I should have paid attention yeah they should make like gourmet um, ones where it's like actually like in an icing bag and you can like pipe it on your face that would be pretty funny i'm like going places my with god this. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> you um, really that really like rejuvenated you didn't it it did it oh. really. technically you guys farley co did send us one more face mask However, we both can't do one face mask. I mean, we could try, but... And this one is creamy coconut, so it would go probably really well with the chocolate one. But we're actually going to give this one away for our 1,000 subscriber giveaway, cool. which should be coming up sometime in the spring. So uh, stay tuned for that. Make sure you hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't subscribed already. You have a chance to win your own 7th Heaven face mask. Boom. Creamy coconut hydrating vitality boost. So, yeah.
Yeah. Join us for that. So join us for that. I guess we'll do our official sign off. So yeah. Um, thanks for watching. Oh wait, it's not my job. Yeah, just stop trying to steal my job. This is my show. Um. So thank you everyone. Yeah. Hear yeah, more. Uh, thank you everyone for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, follow us on various social medias, Instagram. such Seaside as photo Instagram, Seaside Photo Beauty. Yeah. Um, yep. Follow us there. Anything else? No. Okay. Carl will be back um, next Monday. week on Monday for another video. For another video, and I'll be back again next week for another Face Mask Friday. Bye. Hey guys, Ow. it's bonus footage time. Oh, that was fast. Okay, bonus footage time. It's time for the calendar. Whoa, Whoa. it's right here. Who it's the think? 16th today. Is it the 16th today? Yeah. Jeez. Okay. Put it up so we can find it. I found it. Do you want to do it? I'll do it. You do it's it. a big long pencil. Or mascara. Watercolor? Oh. It's an invisible lip contour. So yeah, it seems to be a lip pencil that goes on like a universal lip lip liner, and it's like flesh tone. Huh. But it should be invisible because it says it's invisible. I'm cool. excited to try this one, uh, you guys. Awesome! It looks like fun. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you all later. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Still that from Simply Neological. What? Thanks for watching and we'll see you all next time. Bye! Or whatever she says. Oh, uh, yeah. She does say that, doesn't she? Yep. Bye! <laughs> Bye! <laughs>